So we pulled on our, our, our face mask. Yeah. So this is the old. And so we'll be revealing the new later. <laughs> so we got us a nice driver. Nice little minivan. So we're on our way to our hotel. Hotel Bali, actually. Bali. Hotel Bali with a V. So. Check in later. We're gonna put this key in because this key turns on everything. Right? We'll turn back on the TV. This is our bathroom. sister right there. Mm -hmm. This is our room. We were supposed to get a single room each, but they put us in a double. The TV. That's basically it. That's our beds, double beds. And let's see what the view is out here. This is our view outside. I'll get the front of the building later, so that's it. So today is May 16th and we are going to, the sisters are going to have rhinoplasty on our nose. We're in the Bali Hotel, and tomorrow we're going to be at Academic Hospital to do our rhinoplasty, so stay tuned. Okay, so it's surgery day. They took our blood, signed us, like signed us in, did some paperwork. And um, we did our COVID test. This is probably the worst COVID test I had. They went all the way back in my mouth. And all the way back in my nose was horrible. So they just put us in our rooms. Our rooms are right next to each other, me and my sister. So I'll turn the camera around and I'll show you our rooms. Alrighty, so here's the bathroom. me change into this, this, and they gave me compression socks. Let's see. Front is cut out here. Compression socks. And then these hospital scrubs. Bathroom is really nice though. <laughs> then Today's the day. I'm getting a last couple of looks at my own nose. Decided about my new nose. Oh God. <laughs> it's the nose that God gave me. But girl, we got to alter this a little bit, y'all. Mm -hmm. mm -mm -mm. My sister's in the room right next to me. And, uh, Yeah, we don't even know who's going in first, but it's okay. 
And there was another girl here. She's from the UK. She said she's getting a lift, lipo, or in tummy tuck. So, yep. So we know for a fact that all three of us are his patients for today. So. Mm. Update you in a few. Okay, so today is May 18th, day two. I'm in the hospital, but I am leaving. The doctor gave me the clear to leave today. He's going to see me on... Today's Tuesday. I'm going to see him on Friday, but I am going to his office on Thursday to meet with the other nurses. So they're going to do some stuff here. Anyway, so... They um, gave me the list of prescriptions that I'll be using to clean my nose and, um, and to take different nasal sprays and different things like that. Um, yeah, the lady took this off today to clean it and so I, I can see more of my nose. So I'm already liking how it looks already. Um, the staff in the morning is very nice, better. <laughs> Last night, that same nurse, I try to get her to give me Wi-Fi on my phone. And then she says, I don't understand. She walked away, but she understands English the most here. And she was just not, I think, I think I just had a bad nurse. I don't think everybody has a bad nurse, but... She was just not the right nurse at all. Anyway, but there was a guy that was very helpful. And so my sister kept going to him and he, he like put on her Wi-Fi on her phone. He sent me up on my Wi-Fi because we can't take the taxi. You can't communicate with your family if you don't have the Wi-Fi or WhatsApp or anything. Yeah. So um, my sister left. Hi. Okay, gotta go now. Bye. <laughs> okay, so my sister went back to the hotel to freshen up. And she also took my big luggage with her. And then she's gonna get some breakfast for me and her. Because this breakfast was just like tomatoes, olives, cheese, and tea. And they told me I can't even drink tea or coffee right now anyway. So, uh, yeah, so that's basically where I am. The doctor also came this morning. He talked. He, he's nice. He's good. He's good at what he does. So, and, um, yeah, he said, told my sister that he'd rather her be safe. Sorry, he told me I can't take a shower or anything. He's a little crusty right now. I see it. Oh, God. He told me I couldn't take a shower until so I could freshen it up though. But because I have they took rib cartilage is the fat right here to use to create a bridge. So he doesn't want me to get any of this. The cast is important and he doesn't want me to move anything, you know, get anything wet underneath where he made the decision to get the rib cartilage so anyway so all I'm doing is waiting for the pharmacist now to bring me the prescription so that I can leave hotel is just like two minutes down the street so yeah so okay catch up with you guys bye <laughs> It's day three. Today is May 19th. It's Wednesday. I had surgery on Monday. And, um, I don't know. 
I guess I'm okay. Um, my lips are still chapped. This is how my nose look. I think it's going to be real pretty. I keep looking at it. My nose is stuffy, though. They say that that's normal. But they're going to have me coming tomorrow to, like, clean out the nose or whatnot. And Friday, I believe they're going to take the cast off. So that's where I am. My eyes are a little, you know, puffy. I guess I got to put some more ice on it, but that's okay. Um, I was wearing this before, right here, to kind of let the um, stuff drip down, you know, into the gauze or whatever. But, yeah, so that's where I am, day three. So, I guess I'll just do more when I go to the doctor's office on Thursday and Friday. I'll update you guys. Bye. Okay, it's Wednesday night, May 19th, two days after my surgery, and uh, my nose is stuffy. I'm going back to the hospital tomorrow, and the nurse is going to change my bandages on my, um, here where they took the rib cartilage out, and she's going to clean all this stuff for me, and the doctor is going to take off the cast on Friday. So today is Wednesday. Tomorrow, Thursday, we'll go to the nurse. And then Friday, we will go to the doctor to take off the cast. So this right here, I believe is just like the sewing, the stitches. So I'm not going to touch that out. I don't want to pull that or anything. But I really can't wait to get there tomorrow because can't really breathe through my nose so they'll clear all that out for me and like I said I'm liking what I see the shape of my nose it still kind of still looks like my old nose with the shape of the nostrils and stuff I can see that I can build a bridge I still like wanted a black nose you know <laughs> but I just wanted it to be like here was like really big. I wanted to be a little smaller there. Get to bring this in a bit. Yeah. So I think I think it's gonna look good when I take all this stuff off. So alrighty, keep you guys posted. <laughs> After this, I'll be able to breathe. Mm -hmm. okay. You don't breathe. Uh -oh, uh -oh. Okay. Is that peroxide? I will remove your splints. Oh, something mm -hmm. in there. Yes. Yeah. Okay. And you feel better. Thank you. It's a pretty nose. I saw it. I like mm -hmm. it. Yeah. Very good. <laughs> I'll have to add the debris in there. Uh huh. Sorry. It's okay. I didn't know what to touch because I was like, I don't want to hurt anything. So I stayed like at the tip. Just scared to touch it. Yes. It is not hurt, don't worry. Yeah. Just I will cut your stitch. Okay. 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 This is from the inside? <laughs> yes. Oh, okay. They're not the dissolvable one. Those okay. are what you have no, to take out. No, this, this okay. stitch just splits. Just the, okay. okay. Yes. Well, I feel it. Can, okay. can, can I want okay. the leg? Light? Yes, please. 
That's better? Yes, please. Thank oh, you. Oh, God. Yes. Uh, 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 just a little. Uh, just a little, 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 little. Okay. Yes. Uh, because you have a lot of clothes. Uh, uh, Get it out. Mm -hmm. And the other side. Yeah. No, the other side. Oh, God. Can you turn? Okay. Yes. You can clean better now. Okay. Okay. The what was the stitches in there? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Because there are a lot of ceramic, also, these tapes are sticks out uh, sure. the, yeah. and the skin. You have a lot of oily skin, so afterwards I also recommend to use that rock tame uh, pills. pills. It's good for this oily skin. It helps us a lot. And after three weeks, I recommend you to do some facials, like some cleanings. Two weeks, yes. Cleaning of the skin. Do not forget. Just do not do aggressive things. Okay. Hello everyone, hi. If you made it to the end of this vlog, thank you so much for watching. And so here in this picture is me on the day that I first uh me on the day that I first had surgery and I think it was about maybe six weeks after, so that's the before and after. And also I wanted to um talk about how I looked from the beginning of the vlog to the end. I had just had a baby in January of 2021. And so my skin when I was pregnant was darker and throughout the course and after I had the baby, my skin lightened up. So I don't know if you can see that, you know, in the before and after as well, my face and even till now it slimmed down a lot. And yes, and so the answer is that yes, I did have a rhinoplasty and um, in the after picture, I mean, it's just concealer that I had underneath my eyes. So, so thank you so much for watching this vlog. It took me a long time to post this because I just was not comfortable letting everybody know my business. <laughs> But um, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe on this video. Um, I know I'm going to get a lot of questions about, you know, the doctor and the price and all those things. So whatever your questions are, I am going to respond back to you or I might just do another video and do like a Q&A. And I will answer all of your questions with answers in that video. So thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe as that will help, help the growth of my channel. And until the next video, I will see you guys in the next one. Peace, guys.